Story time! I love story time. This is a good story too. And Mickey and Minnie are right into it because they know that perfect love can cast out fear. This is the story of our Lion of Zion who arises as the son of love, has a big heart over all of us with healing and under his wings. And these guys like this story because they know perfect love can cast out all fear and that we can make this world great again, even in the middle of World War III erupting. Even though uh, the great bear of Daniel 5 has three ribs it's chewing on, which is Crimea, and the last two it just wiped. Even though in verse 6, Daniel 11, in the latter days, would that king of the north uh, on the bedroom community of Persia, would he invade the king of the south? Yep, even though, because the truth is, this story has a good end. Because that uh, the snake... That putrid putrin who's cut uh, the world a new one, making Russia the, into the sphincter of the earth. They're, and I feel so sorry for the loving Russians. There are many. They don't, that's not their war. This is the war of a madman who is, according to the Bible, the beast of the book of Revelation. It is apparent. Who could argue with that? Uh, Christ said that this would happen, that the wheat and the tares could not grow together. This is the dividing line. This is the event that. Uh, splits time. This is the event that Christ said uh, in Matthew 24 that unless these days were cut short, he's trying to cut these t uh, days short with his sword of the spirit of a prophecy, the sword of truth to bring forth his everlasting gospel of love to set all people free by truth. And that's by telling all people to stand still and see the salvation of love. Uh, we do not have to end up as it is prophesied. If you believe that we have unescapable futures, then you have made all uh, revelation and prophecy into uh, nothing more than magic. And it, you're performing witchcraft in your understandings and twisted, looking through a glass darkly, distortionally, and not understanding. I am offering the world a chance to do a Mickey and many, and to realize that this world can be salvaged, that God really meant what he said, and he said what he meant, and that he would cut these days short by his word of prophecy through the word of God. Uh, and Isaiah 4 says that uh, it would be so bad uh, that uh, seven women uh, would have to grab one man because there would be so few men left after that uh, horseman of the apocalypse goes forth, the pale, the black, and the speckled. But praise God, there is another writer, and that other writer is Christ on the white horse. And he's got a, uh, he's got a uh, long bow. And it's for the servant of uh, Isaiah 49, the one who has done everything in vain. I have 8,000 videos, and I have been preaching to nothing but white noise for months. But th that was then, this is now. If you people ignore this channel now, that I have become a Tokyo Rose, sending forth a, a weapon unto Russia to deflate their tires, to send forth a spiritual weapon of love based on the Bible's truth that their leader is the Antichrist. Uh, Rasputin said that the, the, the cat of the abomination would change the rats. The rats would become the mice, believe, and then they would eat the cat. And that is how the earth can be saved early. Daniel 11 even says midway, and then all of a sudden he could be found not. Uh, it is, uh, can go either way. If people will not support this channel and you're ignorant to these words of uh, Russia's doom from Grigory Rasputin, who was deadly accurate about much prophecy, and they know it. That's why they will listen to him when he tells them there will be nothing but a, a crematorium ahead for them. And these are in his words that they can verify. They can look it up and Google it. And I am not lying. So this is the weapon that Donald Trump spoke of just yesterday. He said, you have to have a psychological weapon. Grow up. Send it out. It's war.